or nothing now as he gets around the inside. Hill comes over the top of him though, and now Hill has his man pegged on the inside, sees the finish, 2-0 it will be, and the bronze medal goes to Australia, and John Andrews will finish fourth. Both riders ready, so Kurt Hornet must lead off from the inside. There he goes, and a little bit of a push-off there for Charlie Walsh. But uh, you can bet your life, Niwon doesn't want too strong a push. He wants to lay off now, the big Canadian. Footlights are now taking effect. The dust falls on the velodrome. You can see the shadows caused by the footlights. And I'll wait for this as they go down the back straight. The crowd just loving this tonight. And straight through the water splash there. So they're showing no fear for what's left on the track of the dampness. And up onto the top of the banking. Harnett leads Neil. And Harnett must be afraid of getting new one now. He rarely, if ever, beats him in a sprint, you know. And he's just been out sprinted in a very straight sprint in the first match. So he's got to think again here. Kurt Hornet set the Commonwealth Games record in the 200 metres qualifying round with 10.542 seconds. That's never been equaled since here, even in the match sprinting. Uh, Hill, in fact, has been the fastest in the match sprinting with a 10 7. Out onto their second lap. I'm pretty sure that Gary Newon will not be in any hurry to reach the finishing line. Low Harnett is making sure he doesn't jump clear but the fact is i think it's all down to harnett to do the jumping niwon can carry on doing the stalking because the nearer it goes to the finishing line i think the better chance gary niwon has he's such a complete sprinter and he has a lovely style on the bike as well now listen to the crowd into the home straight prince edward is here by the way and enjoying every minute of the competition here tonight now the sprint will start as Kurt Harnett takes Gary Newon into the last lap and goes low in the bank and just keeps above that red line. Now drops inside, that's his domain. Down the back straight but takes them high again. Up to the top half of the track, still looks at Newon. Now he takes him around the banking. Now Newon comes again heavily on the shoulder of Kurt Harnett into the straight. Newon's going to walk this. There was he walking. Look at this. He's done it. 2 0. 2 0. And the first athlete from Australia to take a gold medal in three consecutive Commonwealth Games. And congratulations to the two coaches there between Canada and Australia. And the pedal power, that is the word. So Gary Newon is the ninth gold medal in cycling for Australia and the one I think we will all remember. He's beaten his best friend Kurt Harnett in two superb sprints and really the best man did win this. So Australia won all but two of the track cycling events, their men winning every race they contested. In a moment we're off to Memorial Arena for Rhythmic Gymnastics, so stay with us.